hello and welcome to Forever Bob Pokemon. Um, I've had quite a few friends express interest in me uh, opening up Pokemon trading card game products. Uh, and they wanted me to do streams and things of that nature, but it's uh, really hard to get everybody together um, to do live streams and stuff. So I thought maybe it would be fun to start making YouTube videos about it. Um, and uh, we'll see how it goes. I'm sure it's going to be very amateurish, especially for the first few videos. Uh, but hopefully I can get to the hang of it uh, soon and, and try to make entertaining content for whoever uh, wants to watch it. Um, but anyways, I'm Forever Bob. And uh, without further ado, why don't we just go ahead and get started. Uh, I thought first off I would do an unboxing of a Miracle Twin Booster Box uh, Japanese set. Uh, this set has a really cool card in it. Uh, a few, few, few really good cards in it, actually. Uh, but the chase card is, of course, the full art Mew Mewtwo Tag Team GX. Uh, so why don't we see if we can pull that. It'll take me eight minutes to open this box, I'm sure. Wait, no. Look at that. You just got to have a little confidence, guys. You can do anything you put your mind to, I swear. Okay. This is the Miracle Twin Tag Team GX booster box. The plastic was just the beginning. Now it's... A, there we go. The Japanese booster boxes are always so cool. I just think... Not only do Japanese products uh, have much better quality than, than American products, uh, like the pack art is just always so nice, and the packs themselves are much nicer. And uh, Japanese is just so fun to look at. Anyways, there are 30 packs in this, and uh, each Japanese booster box is guaranteed one secret rare. And a secret rare is any card that is above the set limit. Um, so if there's a set with 79 cards in it, uh, there are, can be cards, you know, 83 out of 79. That's a secret rare. Um, and you can get more. It's, it's highly unlikely, but, uh, you know, let's try our luck. This is going to be very interesting trying to do this with uh, me being able to see and the camera on the cards. But we'll see how well I do. So there's a card trick with Japanese products. Uh, also, Japanese Pokemon card packs only come with five cards each. You take the back card and you put it on the front so that you're rare or uncommon. Japanese packs don't guarantee rares. Um, so first off, we got Noivern. This is my favorite Pokemon, actually, is the, uh, the Bad Dragon. I am a really big fan of him. Uh, trying to get the camera to focus a little better. I wonder if I can... I wonder if I can manage it. That's pretty good. There we go. Uh, yeah, Noivern is my favorite Pokemon. My favorite Pokemon forever was Rapidash, and then I don't know what it is about this Bad Dragon, but I really like him. So we got Noivern. We got Seawaddle. Purloin. Cot Cotney, right? Is that what that is? And then a trainer card. I don't actually know what this one is. It is an uncommon. Trainer cards can be uh, worth quite a bit of money sometimes, though. Uh, if they're especially if they're in the modern set and are playable, because uh, people who actually play the card game will pay a little bit more to get playable cards uh, that work well with their decks. So there's the first pack. Pack number two. Uh, also, I'm wearing compression gloves because I'm old, uh, aka 28, and my arthritis is uh, acting up today. Um, the joys of, of, of aging. All right. One in the front. What do we got? It's a stadium card, I think. Scraggy. Elect Electros, right? Dedene. And, uh, oof, what is this guy's name? Zank. Something goose, right? Gungoose? Gungoose? Is that what it is? Something like that. It's an Alolan Pokemon. I'm not very good with the last two, uh, the last two regions. Open it this way so we can't see. Card of the front. Got another stadium card. Ella, Ella Gem, right? Di Dynamo? Dynamo? Ar Arch Archeops? No, this is the. That's the evolution. I can't remember that guy's name. Oh, and there's our secret rare already. Um, I'm not sure if I can get it to focus there, but it's uh, 115 out of 94 ultra rare. It's a. Uh, colorless energy 
That's a good pull. I like that. First hit of the day. And you know what I should probably do? I should probably sleeve that bad boy uh, right away. That is a beautiful card. Camera doesn't do it justice. Oops. I need to open them the correct way so I don't spoil it. Jinx. Let's see Waddle again. The Dene. Joltik. And a Yveltal. That's a pretty card. I, I wonder if I can get the camera to focus just any better at all. No? Doesn't want to? What does this button do? Oh my gosh, I did it. <laughs> all I had to do was press one button. The Japanese hollows are really nice because the edges are also hollow. And you know what? I will just leave every hollow I pull from this set. How about that, huh? Why don't we just do that? I'm going to throw all the trash to the side. No, I'm kidding. Every card is created equal. I'm such an old man. I have trouble with these packs. Okay, well, now that that is like that, can I... There we go. That's the that's the one. That's the angle. Uh, Relicanth, right? Dragonair. T Dyna Dynamo. Art. I'm not gonna get that one. Another Yveltal. Back to back. That's fine. I'll take it. We take rares. Anything shiny is is good, right? If we're we're all a bunch of monkeys, we like shiny things, huh? Unfortunately, since our secret rare was the colorless energy, I don't think that we will be getting the uh, the alternate art or the full art of the Mew and Mewtwo, which is fine, because we can still pull the regular version of it, which is still a good pull. I got, like, stuff on my... Sorry. Drapion, right? Whip. Whip. Wimp Wimpod, that's what it is. Drill Burr. A Aegis Aegis Slash. No, that's the evolved. I don't know what this one is. And a Heracross. Nice. Now that the camera is in focus, this probably this card probably looks a lot better. Yeah. Nice. My, with my current setup, I'm like looking through the camera to see what I pull uh, because my phone is huge and like right in the way and I have to have it right in front of me. This is the, another one of those trainer cards. Jupiter, du Elogam, Joltik, and Lapras. Lapras for a while was all uh, one of my fa well it is one of my favorites but it was my favorite for a while when I was a kid because it looks like a big dinosaur there's a there's an old wives tale I don't know if it's true or not I just heard he heard about uh, that some guy used to go around freeing Laprases uh, in like the original uh, red and blue because the in-game explanation of it I'm having trouble with this back was that uh, Laprases were uh, nearly extinct because of po over poaching, etc. And so this guy um, goes around releasing them, and then later, uh, in one of the descriptions for Lapras in one of the later Pokemon games, Elect Electros, that's a nice one, uh, the Nintendo or Game Freak added that because of someone's efforts, uh, Lapras were no longer going extinct. And I know that that uh, that quip is true about about the Lapras uh, that the Game Freak added, but I don't know if they added it because of that guy. But it would be pretty funny if it was if that was a true story. And uh, now that I just told a story about something I'm not sure is true, please go around and tell all your friends that it is true, uh, because that is um, that's just modern news, huh? 
Uh, Sableye. Oof. Slack, 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 slack off. Aegis, Onyx, and another Heracross. It's a decent sized set for Japanese, 94 cards. The Japanese sets, I've noticed, tend to be much smaller uh, than their American counterparts because um, what American sets will generally do is they'll like, combine several Japanese sets into into one set like I'm pretty sure but I'm pretty sure this one just became um, Unified Minds was the English set Scra Scrafty Scrafty or Scraggy this is Aegis this one's Aegis Slash Noibat the baby bat that turns into my favorite Dynamo ooh and an Aerodactyl GX that's a nice card I like that I remember when I was a little baby boy what like eight seven when the uh, Pokemon Kanto League series was coming out, that episode with Aerodactyl scared the crap out of me when I was a kid. <laughs> oh, there was a thing I was going to do. I was going to have a glass of wine, or a sip of wine uh, with every good pull I get. So we've had two good pulls, so two sips. I think that would make the streams more, or the videos more interesting the later on they get, because uh, I have a very low tolerance. Nowadays, when I was younger in college, uh, it wasn't the case. Okay, this pack is... I'm having a lot of trouble with these packs. I feel like each set, the packs open a different way. Steelix, Vigoroth, Fossil. I know this one. Bear... Bears... Bears, Bears, Gula, something? Oh, I can't remember. And another, uh, something goose. Gun goose. Gun goose, right? I'll try to open the packs, like, within camera's view, but I'm inexperienced at this. So we got Sableye, Slack Off, Yanma. Tor, 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 something, torches, and slacking. Nice. This looks like looks like Peter Griffin. This looks Family Guy style art. It's interesting. It's funny is some of the arts on like the really rare expensive cards are not very good compared to the art style of like some of the cheaper cards or, or rares in a set. And I like to collect the cards, uh, not just based on rarity and how much they're worth, but based on how much I like the art. Because some of the arts are just so cool. Oh, one on the front. Doing this through the camera lens is really hard. Uh, I can't remember the name of that one. Uh, execute. Uh, Ranguru. Dragonair. And an Excadrill. I think that's a cool Pokemon. It's a good addition to the whole Pokemon franchise, in my opinion. There's not enough moles. That's what that's what I say. Uh, I'm having so much trouble with these packs. Okay, there we go. This is so embarrassing and amateurish. That's the way the news goes, right? Oh, I can't remember the name of the Elded. I can't remember. Can't remember that one either. Wimpod. Young Goose. Ooh, who, oh, who's this? I can't remember who this is. It's an Alola girl. I can't remember. It's a good... It's a nice card, though. That is a nice card, though. Sleeve. I'll have to find a way to... Oh, there we go. Is that still in focus? No. Okay, so for it to be in focus, it has to... Okay. I'll figure something out for the next video. Sorry for the how close the camera is to the cards. I wonder if I put it up a little bit. That'd probably be better, yeah? Yeah, that's probably that's way better. Trial run. This video is just a trial run, huh? There we go. Turn around. Noivern. What is... Drillbur. Why not... 
Flay, 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 Flanion. And a... Uh, uh, oh, what is this one called? What is this one called? Um, bre oh, man. I can't remember. I know it. I know the Pokemon. If you said if you said like the first two letters, I could finish it. Be, be, the wine is already working. Two sips. That's all it takes. Uh, deuce, deuce. I can't remember what the evolution is. Scrafty. Why not? Ele Electros and ooh, Galisopod. Gol Goliospod? Galisopod? One of those. One of the two, A or B. Let's see that pack opened real nice. That pack opened real, real good. Oh, I don't know who that is. Tauros, Drape, Scorypi, Drape. Ah, oh, it's one of those. Sea Waddle. Oh, what a good pull. Tyranitar and Sableye tag team. GX. That's a pretty card. I love that. That's a nice card. You know, it's so nice. I think I'll give it a sleeve. How about that, huh? And we'll do a sip. Of $7 rosé. Uh, let me get a new, there we go, new pack of sleeves, because we're running low. All right. One to the front. F uh, some, uh, fun fungus? F f something, Gus? Some fungus? Dratini? Yan Mega? Drillber? Or... Yeah, Drober. And Ter Ter Terracon. Ter Terrakiodon. Ter Terra. We'll call him Terry. Terry the... Terry the cow. Cow thing. Bull. Bull thing. What is he supposed to be? Just some... Like a rhino? Just some four-legged random thing? Who knows? One to the front. Some sort of scouter. Something something power level 9000. Orangaroo. Aegis slash. Something some fung, 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 fungi. Fungus. This one's Drapion, right? This is Drapion. The big scary spider man. Spider thing. Spider guy. Spider girl. We don't. We don't misgender here. Spider thing. How about that? That was awesome. I opened that pack amazingly, huh? Noibat. Eight. Sword. Bug. What is this one? I didn't... There's a third evolution? I can't remember the third... I, I gotta be honest, I didn't know there was a third evolution for this Pokemon. For the sword. For the inanimate objects. So his second evolution, right? Or so his first evolution is a sword. The second evolution is two swords. The third evolution, he eats his twin and gains a shield instead. That's interesting. It's very brutal. Very sad. Pokemon is mired in sadness. Joy and sadness dance together far into the night. I heard that on a TV show once. So the Japanese packs, they have like they have like the outside wrapper, but then the inside wrapper, there's like there's like two layers to it. They're so well made. And it's just so hard to get like if you screw it up, it's so hard to get the like the inside layer out. Okay. One in the front, turn around. Ar Archeops, right? Flanion. Slats uh plant. Lipard, kitty, kitty cat, big cat, large cat. We've got a few packs left. The 
trick is to just rip it off like a band-aid at the start so you don't screw up the pack. One to the front. Uh, big spider. Fossil. Uh, fish. Bug. And a normal version of the secret rare that we got, the colorless energy. One to the front. I think since we got a tag team, we're not going to be able to get the Mew and Mewtwo. Executor. Bug. Dragon. Little spider baby. Dragonite. Oh, that's a nice card. I like that. So like, this card probably isn't worth very much, but it's just so pretty. It's just so pretty, huh? How many pulls have we? How many good pulls? I think we've got three good pulls, right? We have the Aerodactyl, the Colorless Energy, and then the Tag Team. Tyranitar Sableye tag team. Which is a great card. I'm gonna make a fine addition to my collection. One of the front. It's koala. It's a fish. Eggs. Uh, it's sloth. And a Celebi. I love Celebi. One of my favorite legendaries. It's a nice one. This video is probably gonna be really long. If anybody's still here. Thank you very much for watching. Booster boxes are, you know, they're a lot. And I'm inexperienced. I don't know how Leon Hart and Max Mofo do it. They're crazy. One of the front. Turn around. Whim, whim, whims, whimsy cot, right? Turtle. Uh, pull up your pants. Uh, plant. Tort. Big, big turtle. Huge turtle. I think I should get one more pull in this booster box if the math is is right. One in the front. Turn around. Relicanth. Do Jupiter. Onyx. Uh, Scorpion. And blue, I think is what it would be. It's either blue or Gary. Kind of the same person, kind of not. Something, something. Alternate dimensions. Pokemon loves alternate dimension stuff. Misty. Oh, I love a full art of this one. This is such a pretty full art card. Uh, fish. A big bull. Little plant. And a... Oh, there, what is the name of this legendary? Can't remember. Ne Nexacron? Ne Necrozma. Necrozma. That's what it is. I did it. One of the front. Turn it around. Big big spider. Dragon. Kitty kitty cat. Oh. Little thief. Eel and a mana potion. To restore magic. Potion seller. I require your strongest potion. You cannot handle my strongest potion adventurer. They are too strong for you. One of the front. Lapras. Sword. Uh, mongoose thing. Fungus. And what is this one? Buh. Buh. Breloom. Breloom. I did it. We're going to have another sip because there's only one pack? One pack left. <coughs> Two sips. Two sips and a cough. It would be really cool if we could have some last pack magic. Let's find out. Some sort of thing. Some sort of rodent. Some sort of bird. Some sort of gem. And oh, Dragonite GX. Last pack magic. Excellent. That's another cool card. I love it. Nice. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. What a good pull. All right. That's the whole box. Let's do a brief recap of what we got. First off, we got the Dragonite. We got the Necrozma, the Celebi, another Dragonite, the the Carnivore, the Bull, the Tyranitar Sableye Tag Team. That's such a cool card. The uh, Galiciopod, the Girl, the Peter Griffin, 
Aerodactyl, the Eel, and two Eveltals in the Secret Rare. Excellent. Well, if you watched the whole thing or you just skipped to the end, thank you so much for joining me for my first ever Pokemon unboxing video. I'll try to make the next one uh, a little more entertaining and uh, um, try to have the camera focused better next time, too, for the first part of the video. Sorry about that. Um, anyways, this is Forever Bob, and uh, I'll see you next time, hopefully. All right, have a good one.